a square field with side 30 centimeters is surrounded by a path of uniform width. If the area of the path is 256 centimeters squared, its width is dash. So, uh, first understand what is given in the question. There is a square field, okay, whose side is 30 meters. So, 30 meters, uh, 30 meters, right? And then it is surrounded by a path of uniform width. So, this is also going to be a square, right? I don't know this width. I am going to take it as x. So, this is also x, this is also x and this is also x. So, this is 30 plus 2x and this is also 30 plus 2x. Right? Now, uh, if the area of the path is 256 centimeters squared, it with this dash. This area, right, this shaded region area is given as 256. You have to find out the value of x. Now, actually, how do you find out the region of the shaded area? It is nothing but the area of the outer uh, square minus the area of the inner square. That is nothing but 30 plus 2x, the whole squared minus 30 squared correct that is the area of the shaded region now this is given as 256 now how do you expand this see a square it is of the form a squared minus b squared correct that is the easier way to solve it so this will be nothing but a plus b into a minus b that is 30 plus 2x minus 30 into 30 plus 2x plus 30 correct or this is equal to uh, you have 2x into 60 plus 2x that is equal to 256 correct now this uh, you can cancel out some common terms here right 2 this can be 128 so now you have uh, 60x plus 2x squared is equal to 128 again cancel out see if, it, if you cancel out it's always easier to calculate so again 2 gets cancelled throughout so this will be 30 and uh, 64 Correct. So, you have x squared my, uh, plus 30x minus 64 that is equal to 0. Now, uh, now what do you do? Now, you have to find out the roots. So, you have two numbers whose product is 64 and whose sum is going to be 30. So, the numbers can be what? See, 32 and 2. 32 into 2 is 64. 32 minus 2 is 30. Now, again, you have a plus and a minus symbol sign here correct so when you look at the roots uh, of such an equation which has a plus and a minus like this okay the roots will be the smaller root has to be positive and the bigger root has to be negative so this root is going to be positive and this root is going to be negative okay so this is going to be your roots of this equation so you know there is only one positive value here so x has to be equal to 2 so 2 is your correct answer see actually you needn't even uh, uh, okay, one way of doing it is like this. Other way, you can actually check out with the options also. If you feel that is a faster way to do. Okay, correct answer is option D that is 2 meters. Okay, so how you go with the options is, see, you know, uh, this square, right? This is 30 into 30. This uh, area is 30 into 30, right? 30 into 30 is the area of the inner square. Now, you know the area of this shaded region also. That is equal to 256. So, the area of this outer square is nothing but 30 into 30 plus 256. This is equal to the area of the outer square. Okay. So, if you solve this 30 into 30 plus 256, you get it as 1156. Now, if this is a square, remember this is a square. Okay. So, what will be one side? See, now what is this 1156? It is nothing but the area of this big square. So, what is the uh, one side of the square? It is nothing but root of 1156, which you get as 34. So, what does that mean? This length is now 34. So, what has to be this value? It has to be 2. Okay. That's the easy way or the smart way to solve that.